of those lamb chops for you. And a nice, beautiful mint pesto. Oh, smells like summer. Great flavor. Classic with the lamb. Let's check out this lamb. Oh, very nice. Look at that. Come on, now. Look at that nice piece of fat right there. This you can just melt right in there. Got some nice marbling, lean piece of meat on the outside. That's exactly what we're looking for. You could probably do these all by themselves, but I'm gonna go ahead and make them look like hockey sticks. <laughs> Why not? We're at the ball hockey tournament, and these can stand on their own, but we're gonna cut them up, individualize them, make them taste oh so good with this mint pesto. A mint pesto, it's an Italian no-cook sauce, usually done with basil, but we're going to use the mint. I'm gonna hit a little parsley in here for some pepper flavor. And how about some buttery pine nuts right here? Flavor, add some consistency to our pesto. About heating it up just a little bit with some red pepper flakes. Mmm. Garlic and lamb classic together. Serious flavor pop there. Now we're gonna zest in a little bit of lemon. With this lemon, I'm gonna hit it twice. My favorite part, too, squeezing that. There's juices out there. A little extra virgin olive oil. Yes! We have liftoff! <laughs> Just pour this in here. But remember, save about a third of it for a little basting later on. Hit it with a little flavor pop when it's on the grill. Put them in a baggie here. Wait. Can you mush that for me? <laughs> and what's your name? It's Jenny. Jenny, Jenny very nice it. to meet you. Just mush that up for me. Get all those flavors <laughs> coated around those lamb chops. 600 people here at the ball hockey tournament. Setting a record out here today. Nicely done. Nicely done. Now that we've mushed, thanks to Jenny, this will go in the fridge for five hours' time. Hey, the Charlotte, everybody. Yeah, I love the Charlotte. Yeah. The road grill team right there. Now, these have been marinating for five hours, and they're ready to hit the grill. Let's go. I can honestly say, I've never had a cheer like that for oil in my grill before. That's what you gotta do. No messy cleanups over here. Now we're looking for medium high heat, and that's five steamboats, okay? Ladies, can you count with me? I need five steamboats. One steamboat, two steamboats, three steamboats, four steamboats, five steamboats. Perfect, that's exactly what we're looking for. Directly, I'm gonna place these beautiful lamb chops directly over the heat. Listen to this. Oh, it's a good sound, isn't it? Now, we're looking for medium to medium rare on this. It doesn't take long at all. Three to four minutes aside, and you're good to go. Flip these over now, see if we got some nice char marks. Remember that beautiful mint pesto that we set aside? Left some, a little basting action. That's exactly what I'm gonna do here. Hit it again with a little shot of flavor. This mint pesto will go great with a nice piece of grilled fish. Gary, how are your chops coming over there? They're doing awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Beautiful. You know what? We're going to take these off the grill. We're going to tend them for five minutes, and then we're going to chow down. What do you say? You want to join me? Yeah! Let's do it. Because we've got some serious lamb chops for you. Y'all ready to see this? Uh-huh. Yeah. These lamb chops have been resting nice and comfortable for the last five minutes or so underneath this foil. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> 